Ooh, that's quite a bit of heat. That feels really good. We're in the middle of the woods, streaming my YouTube channel. It's so nice and toasty in here right now. See how long it takes to get that nice and warm. You guys see it? Yeah, it's something watching us right there. Well guys, we're out in the middle of the woods. Me and my daughter, she's actually in there sleeping right now, but let me show you my setup. I had to do a ton of shoveling to be able to get in here because none of this was plowed. You can see my moon shade. I got the moon walls on there and I just use snow to kind of like help keep it all down. And then it has those big magnets, super powerful magnets on there holding it on. I also use these clips to just kind of keep it really tight to kind of help keep heat in there and a little bit for privacy because we're right by this road and we're also going to be using it for a bathroom in there tonight. The main thing I want to try to demonstrate in this video is this Vesta by Insta fire here's a couple of their canned heats these are six hour canned heats i got a bunch more in the van uh, the bottom is the part for the cooking if i can get that off you can put three of them in there i'll demonstrate that and uh, the top is this part that's actually meant for the heater so it's got these like metal channels to kind of channel the heat obviously the back has a built-in thermal fan to really circulate the heat so this should be interesting supposedly it'll heat up to 200 square feet here's the other side of the moonshade and there's the door we'll be using and then I also want to show you guys, I got this new, what's it called? High boost uh, cell phone booster or cell service booster. So this will actually help me get service. And it also helps my internet service be a lot faster. So it's actually Sunday night right now and the Super Bowl comes on tonight. So I actually want to set up my tablet and try to uh, connect to the hotspot on my phone because it should be fast enough to be able to stream the Super Bowl. So this should be fun to watch the Super Bowl out in the woods. So you can see I didn't put any snow right on that edge here because I want to be able to walk in here. And we got two chairs in here. We got our little cup holders in there. Here's our new portable toilet we're using. This thing folds down. I'll probably show you later. And then you got these uh, like garbage bags. You just put a little garbage bag. You just lift this up, put a garbage bag in there just in case you have to go, uh, you know, do the business. Then I got sealed really good there so nobody could see us. And then obviously I have all the window shades on. If somebody has to go to the bathroom, the other person will just stay in there, shut the door. And that person will have privacy. So here's the inside of the van. I don't have my power station right here because I'm actually going to be sleeping on this chair. This actually folds completely flat. I'll demonstrate that tonight. So that's where I'll be sleeping. And my daughter will be sleeping on the cot. So this will be my first time trying to sleep too. Right now I just have a bunch of these canned heats. I got the Instafire ones and then I have these uh, other ones right here. I think these were a little bit cheaper, which is why I got some of those. On the door side, I'm just kind of using one clip and clipping it from the inside to just kind of help keep it a little bit more closed. It's not gonna be as closed as the, the other side, obviously, that has all of them pinched on there. something quick and simple some uh, breakfast skillet i know it's not breakfast but i don't really care i had one of these laying around I'll try to boil some water on this and uh, have this right now looks like we need 10 fluid ounces just about right on 10 all right these flames are going here i'm gonna put this little probably put it right at the back put the top on make sure that's up so i can grab it all right we're gonna start a timer and see how long it takes to uh, boil this water Awesome is we have all these window shades on so nobody can see in here and obviously we have this space out here so we got total privacy go out just open this up put that on there that right out guys i cannot wait to eat this food like i have not been this shaky in a while i just it was just a lot a lot of shoveling um I don't know, just, I kind of got stuck a little bit, so then I had to shovel even more. And obviously for the uh, moonshade area, it was just like real wet. It was like hard on top, so I need to eat. So that's why I'm not filming too much right now, because I'm like getting the jitters. My daughter was at her friend's house last night, so I'm sure they were up late, so that's why she's napping. I'm actually pretty tired too. But I said, it's a beautiful day, so let's get out here, do some uh, winter camp and test out this Vesta Insta Fire. Here's what she looks like from the road. So you can see it looks very private. 
nothing you can see in. The only way you could see in is if you walked up and looked right in those two holes. That's where I use my uh, AC tubes for the summer. I do have the filler pieces. I could close that back up during the winter. It's just, it's not a big deal. Let's go back in here quick. I doubt it's boiling, but you never know, I guess. It's been six minutes, almost seven minutes. Nope, no boiling yet. Feels warm there though. There's definitely putting off some heat. Show you guys how I ran that cell booster next time when I'm by myself. But you can see that little puck thing right there. That's where it actually puts the signal out to boost my uh, signal and get more service. Of course, I always have my carbon monoxide detector. Zero carbon monoxide, but I'll actually leave it uh, right around here so it's close by that thing. Fortunately, the Vikings did not go to the Super Bowl. So I'll sit here with my little Vikings cup while I watch uh, the Chiefs and the Eagles play tonight. It's warm. Oh, it is boiling. All right. Well, it took 20 minutes to boil. Carefully. It may have been boiling for a little bit there, but it wouldn't have been too long. Uh, set this up here. Now we got to wait five minutes, stir again, and then reseal. Let's stand an additional four minutes. Four more minutes. All right, it's starting to get chilly out here, so I'm gonna put this thing on there while we're not cooking food. Let's see if this thermal fan kicks in here. And it is, there is cold air coming in, obviously, from in here. So it probably won't kick in as quick because it's pretty chilly in here right now. Oh, it's kicking on. It basically took 30 to 35 seconds to uh, start blowing some heat. So my first time using a thermal fan is pretty sweet. Came it back out here because this is where I plan to be for the game. Definitely feeling some heat right here. Oh yeah, it feels really good. Time to eat this uh, breakfast skillet. As long as it's cooled down enough, there's definitely a lot of heat coming from it still. Mmm, it's pretty good. I said I'm so shaky right now, I need to eat badly. So definitely still chilly out here right now, but hopefully that heater will start heating it up. The real test will start once we get in the van and shut that up. Walked up right here. Oh my gosh, I'm feeling the heat right here for sure. It might take a while to really uh, get it in this area, but standing up above it right here, there's definitely a good amount of heat coming off of this thing. I mean, I'm sitting down in a chair that's pretty low, and like I said, I just, you know, turned the fan thing on. So what I'm going to actually do is I'm going to take three more of these canned heats. I'm going to put a couple, try to be safe, obviously. I'm not going to put it next to that, but find a good spot to put a couple in here and see if we can heat this area up more. And then obviously I'll test this more by itself tonight in the van when we're both uh, cooped up in there. I'm gonna actually try this other brand of canned heat by 7 Pen, 7 Pen True Heat. It actually comes with this little thing. I tried to twist it. It's, oh yeah, I guess I can do it by myself. I thought maybe I needed it, but this one uh, looks a little different. Not the whole thing doesn't stick out. So we'll see how this does. Let's safely put it right there. Just probably put two like right here. Ooh, that's quite a bit of heat. That feels really good. So I'm gonna put the third one back here. I just gotta obviously be careful. We don't bump it or forget it's back here. lit you can barely see it move those garbage bags i think it's lit yep tell there's actually quite a bit of cold air coming from under here and i think the wind's kind of blowing this direction so i'm going to actually put some snow right here all right so you can see i added some snow underneath the van right there to block that uh, drifting air that was coming so that should really help warm it up. I'm actually already starting to feel uh, quite a bit of a difference. Bald Eagle flew right over us. Awesome.
can see I'm hot spotting my uh, tablet from my phone here. So let's see, let's click on my most recent video. If you guys haven't seen this video, make sure to check it out. It's that negative 21 Fahrenheit video. We're in the middle of the woods, streaming my YouTube channel. It's so nice and toasty in here right now. Wow, I'm just loving my setup. It just keeps getting better and better. Oh, this is awesome. Well guys, I lit a fourth because I want it really warm. Like I could literally almost take my hoodie off right now. Look at this beautiful uh, sunset here. Yo, the animals are coming out now. Well, it's real dark now, so I am going to turn this light on here. Boom. I can see. So I got the game going. I'm going to try out these Hickory Farmhouse. Be a little snack while the game's on. I think we got this for Christmas or something, so I said I better eat this before it goes bad. So... Looks pretty good. Ooh, it's even got those little strawberry things. I haven't had these in forever. Every day delicious. I agree. The crackers and like some kind of sausage thing and like different cheeses. Yeah. Not many in there. Do you take this off? I'm not sure if I was supposed to take this skin off. I'm going to take it off anyways because it peeled right off. We got those uh, different cheeses and that sausage with the crackers here. It's pretty good, actually. So we are about to have some hot cocoa. So my daughter just put water in it here. I just got to slap, hold it tight because I don't want it to dump on my iPad. All right, now let me take this off if I can. Oh, I need two gloves. Put that there. We got our teapot on there and... Let's press. All right, we got the pot on there. We'll see how long it takes to boil that water. Hot cocoa with mini marshmallows, yes. This one's different. My cup. A never truly solo. God is always with me. Get that on the merch store. All right, I think it's warm enough. I'm hoping it's not boiling, but uh, I definitely don't want it really boiling, to be honest. Let's just hope it's warm enough. Yeah, it looks warm. How much water do you want in there? Mm. That much? A little more. I don't want it too watery. Fine. All right, I'm gonna try the first sip. It's not quite as warm as I'd like, but it's definitely warm. It's just, I'm gonna have to drink it pretty fast. Otherwise, uh, it'd be a little too cold. So that was, uh, I think that was around 12 minutes. It got warm, but it wasn't quite hot as I would like it. So I think an extra two to three minutes would have been perfect. We still had quite a bit of water left after that hot chocolate. So I slapped it on for another probably been five minutes and looks like it's just about boiling it may even be boiling but usually it'll start screaming so she's about to have some chicken ramen noodle so if you want to open that up and put that in the bowl we can pour the water in there i think it actually is boiling i just don't think there's enough water in there yeah i could feel it like shaking About to have some Campbell's chunky soup. This is sirloin burger with country vegetables. See how long it takes to get that nice and warm. Part seven minutes, guys. Oh yeah, very, very warm. Only took seven minutes to make this soup really, really warm. I'll just eat it right out of this. This bad boy back on it. About to try this hamburger soup. Well, the Super Bowl is over, so we're going to go for a night walk and uh, see some animals out here. The Chiefs won, so pretty good game. I didn't really care who won, honestly, but we're going to go for a walk, see if you can see some eyes. There's the van, so you can kind of see those two little holes where the AC for the summer is. They got my light on in there, so you can see a little bit because of that light. But if I didn't have that light on, you wouldn't really see much at all. 
not wait till summer. Pretty big footprints right there. They look very recent. There's something barking. Oh, this area is weird. I don't know if I've been to this area before. It's like really open. Look at this, look how far you can see. If I had my bright flashlight right now. Oh my gosh, what do I see? Yep, yep, eyes, eyes, eyes. Animal, right? See if you guys can see it. Yeah, you'll see two eyes. What is it? It's looking right at us. See it? I don't know what it is. You guys see it? Yeah, it's something watching us right there. Dude, I see it running. Who's trying to eat it? Just in case. This is where I actually saw my first uh, black bear. What? There's a lot of coyotes screaming out here and stuff. So. You saw black Turn all the lights off. Boom. We're in the middle of the woods right now. With all the animals. We can't see anything. Oh, our light. my light don't work. I'm just kidding. What would you do? Uh, I'd use my phone as a light or use that light you have. Wish I had my bright flashlight. It would show this whole area. That'd be really cool. I'm getting some brighter flashlights coming soon, guys. That'll be sweet. There's the van. Home sweet home. Can't believe I just watched the Super Bowl right here. That was insane. Well, that one's just about done right there. The other ones are probably getting close to. See it's smoking. Hit it like this. Call like a snuffer or something. Those ones are all burnt out. Completely empty. I'm gonna put three brand new ones in and see if we can get it nice and toasty in here. We'll see the difference from inside the van to outside the van in probably like 30 minutes. You could open it. It's lit. Here we go. Let's see how warm it gets in here. Here's my bed tonight. Just a basically flat chair. If I had like a little pillow right there, that'd probably be perfect to keep me a little bit more flat. We just started this thing. We got all three of them going currently. And it is 23 Fahrenheit outside and it's 47 in here. So we'll see how much more it'll warm it up. Under one side, they have this thing called the snuffer. And the other side has this little like part. Let's see if you can see it right here. Where you can hook underneath this and it'll pull it out just in case it's really hot. And then obviously if I wanted to snuff it, I could just go like that. And then to push it back, can you see my hand? You can just push it back like that. And then you obviously put this back underneath here and I'll click right back in there. See that thermal fans going really fast right there, blowing that heat out. Well guys, it is actually 70 degrees in here and it's only 24 outside. So this thing definitely works really good at heating up and it definitely boiled and you could like cook some real food on this thing. It gets that hot. Like it's blowing some serious heat right now. If I was to hold this right here for a while, this thing would probably go up to well over 100 but i do have both of these windows cracked so there's good ventilation in here got my carbon monoxide detector so we're actually going to sleep with this thing on um and this is where i'm going to be sleeping so i got this thing pretty flat she's already in the zero degree sleeping bag so she might be hot i am going to put this candle out though we don't need that going tonight so you guys can see here's my setup here i'm just laying on my back i feel pretty comfy my feet are on the ground but my knees are on here then my full head is on here so i'm about to turn off these lights
Well, didn't get to bust out the new toilets, uh, but at least we had it just in case. Just goes like that, I think. And then it folds. Well, guys, I'm all packed up as you can see. Uh, it's definitely way colder today than it was yesterday. It was pretty cool. I got to watch the Super Bowl from the middle of the woods, which uh, was only possible because of this new cell phone booster thing. Got to try out that uh, Vesta by Instant Fire thing. Definitely works good. It's not quite as warm as a Mr. Buddy heater on low, but it's it's pretty close because I got it up to a pretty high degree inside the van there. But I'm going to head out of here, guys. See you guys in the next one. Peace. Four, five, at least five deer right there. Sweet. Oh no, there's more over there. Dang, there's a ton.